Hello, my name is Dane and I work for Libraries and I and today I would like to welcome you to our craft activity in Greystone Library. So help me today is my uh, son Kaleo. Hello. He's helping previous ones. Uh, can you show the camera just what it is we're building? So we're building a caterpillar and what I like about the caterpillars is you can do this and then whenever it's on the ground you can like make uh, it move. It has a segmented it. body. Yeah. So We'll start here. We have prepared some bits earlier. So what I have used is a sippy cup. And I have just made the, the sizes. You can see them there. And just for time purposes, I've already cut some of these out. So Carol, if you would be good enough to cut these ones here out, right? please. Really good, like, it's, like, it's, it's mostly done. So, this is where we're at, and if we had more time, we'd be using Crit Stick or glue to join the segments. But as we don't have, uh, I will staple the parts today. Now I'm going to just, have you got one done there already? Uh, yeah. Let me just see if I can get this one done. So we're using safety scissors, uh, which I find easier to work with than the, the larger scissors anyway. So, once you have that done, you're just folding that part, uh, much like these here. So I'm folding this segment here, uh, about halfway. The number of segmented sections you use is entirely up to yourself. I think in the two previous ones, I went with 20, uh, but it doesn't have to be as much as that. So just carry on cutting the rest of it there, like so. Please. So that's that one there. In there. And just with alternate colours, so we've went with green, pink, uh, green, pink, and then so we have the the green here again. One, two, three. So uh, now, and just for the head to have it slightly different, I'm going to do a yellow one. So we'll cut that out. I've again, I've already marked the circle out with the, the sippy cup. already been off on holiday. Really excited. Uh, oh, I, I meant to say, you've been reading. What have you been reading lately? Goosebumps. Goosebumps. What did you think of, of Goosebumps? Good. You seem to really like it. Now, I'm just going to draw the face on here. It's really just the, the mouth. So, just a circle there to give it definition. Same at the other side. And then, for like cheeks. Mm -hmm. And then just freehand, just a circle or a semi circle around to the other side. But don't do the top bit if it's a circle. And then we have our eyes. So, oops. Well, you have all the segments cut out? Yeah. Very good, son. And that's the other eye. Always like, what do you call the eyes? Googly eyes. Googly eyes. It's good to so, say that. So there are the eyes. Now, so we'll just put some more segments on the body here. And good job cutting them out, Kalel. So we'll just go on just halfway, approximately. Okay. And so that's going on there. And as I say, really the number of segments that you use to the body is is entirely up to yourself. There's some more greens I prepared earlier. You know, and you don't have to have it uniform colours. You could have it whatever colours you like. It's red. So now with the the face we really will have to just because we don't want a staple showing in the front. So I will put some print stick on here. the face and it's just going on there okay so you can see how he's coming along and Claire, could you cut out 
just the, the antenna there for us. Okay. Uh, so here's antenna I've done before. Um, so just in case. So with the, if you like the wee baubles at the top of the antenna, it really as you can see there, I've just done a circle. Um, whatever size you feel, you know, and if you want them say even, just fold it over. I'll cut it out twice. So I'll do that. How are you getting on there, son? Good. There's those there. Get the antenna on it. That's one of our previous ones. I really like the, the hedgehog. I like the hedgehog. It's like a finger puppet. You just put your finger in there. There. There goes there. Oh, and again, just put a stick to put it onto the. Maybe looks more like an alien than a caterpillar, but it's supposed to be a caterpillar. <laughs> so, what do you think, son? Good. So there we go. So that's it. As I say, you can do as many segments as you like to it. So there you have your three caterpillars or family of caterpillars. So thanks for joining us today. Um, keep an eye out for Libraries and I website for ebook and uh, magazine offers. So. Thanks for joining us. Bye. Bye.